did you know original equipment components are only the starting point in our product design process? In fact, they represent only the minimum standard of performance for us. DIS coils like these are an excellent example of how our engineers replicate product specs and then make improvements to overcome OE design shortcomings. This kind of thing happens here every day. A principal cause of coil failure is arcing between the secondary or outer winding and the primary or inner winding of a coil. Ouch! Jeez, don't do that. This destroys the coil and often takes the ignition control module with it. It's important to note when replacing a failed module to always test the coil. A failed coil is often the cause for unnecessary module failure. Obviously, you should try to determine what caused the coil to fail in the first place. For example, a bad ignition wire is a common cause of this problem. Why does this happen, and what did we do to stop this? Current in any electrical system is always trying to find the path of least resistance. When this path is blocked for any reason, it will look for the next easiest way through the system. Unfortunately, the passage it finds in the OE design coil is to arc between the windings, or often through the bottom of the coil, using the module as a high voltage conductor. Our engineers developed a highly effective fix for this OE design shortcoming. As you can see here, our coil has a dielectric sleeve inserted between the windings. These sleeves stop arcing and therefore prevent this common coil failure. There you have it, problem solved. OE doesn't have this innovation nor do any of our aftermarket competitors. Another Wells advantage.